Hey, Curious Cats, I look like a Sith today. Well, as close as I could look to a Sith at any given time. Because I am a Sith, because it's Revenge of the Fifth. Do you like the Marvel Netflix shows? I only really enjoyed Jessica Jones and Luke Cage. Uh, Jessica Jones and Luke Cage were also my favorite. I Daredevil, oddly enough, was too gruesome for me, which feels weird. It was like it alternated between me being very bored and me being very grossed out. So I, I didn't really like it that much. Season 2 especially. I know a lot of people like Daredevil, so I'm sorry to say that. But I just... Um, he's never been one of my favorite heroes. The concept of, of his powers have never, has never intrigued me or anything. So I think it's just him as a superhero that I'm like, I didn't watch, uh, Iron Fist because nothing I saw about it looked interesting to me. I've seen the story of a rich kid has to get his fortune back a million times. And I've also seen white man really good at Kung Fu a million times. So I just wasn't, I just wasn't interested. Um... Are there any other Marvel Netflix shows, or is that all of them? I'm kind of nervous now about The Defenders because of Iron Fist uh, and because of the trailer I saw. It, I don't know. I wish that they would watch Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 and be like, oh, this is how we make it fun to have a group of assholes together. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it'll be fine. Uh, guilty pleasure, fast food, we just don't give a fuck. I never give a fuck. So I eat bean burritos from Taco Bell all the time. I like to get uh, the double cheeseburger meal from McDonald's. Um, those are probably the only two guilty pleasures. Oh, McFlurries. I'm obsessed with Oreo McFlurries. One movie everyone else loves that you think is overrated. Most movies. <laughs> I'm really picky when it comes to movies. I don't like a lot of movies that everybody else likes because I really liked fantasy. So growing up like in the 80s and stuff like that and early 90s, I and having older sisters who often taped or like showed me older stuff, I really just like fantasy. And... Most movies nowadays cannot do fantasy properly because they're too worried about making it realistic. So, and then also, there's just a lot of things I don't like. I get really bored by stories about white men. I know that sounds a little racist. It might be prejudice. It's not racist because I'm not holding those white men back. But I get a little bored. Uh, so, like, Back to the Future, I never liked it. I, I can't watch it to this day. It, it bores the crap out of me. Uh, what's another movie that everybody loves? Iron Man, the first one. I didn't really like it. I couldn't get past the first few minutes. I've heard it's an amazing movie. Maybe if I was, like, drunk and couldn't move off the couch and it came on, I, too, would know that it was a good movie. But uh, I just I didn't, didn't like the attitudes of anybody. I didn't like the base story, so I didn't watch it. I love Iron Man in the other movies. Um, him as a character, but the movie itself just wasn't my thing. Spider-Man. I haven't liked any Spider-Man movies. I just don't like Spider-Man. I never have. Never. And I'm not going to see the new Spider-Man either, which makes other people angry. Uh, me and my girlfriend might possibly be visiting the U.S. We're thinking of visiting L.A. Uh, I recommend you visit the Griffith Museum. It's one of my favorite museums. It's an observatory, Griffith, Griffith Observatory. It's a park, so you can hike up there. And then you can go to the planetarium. You can check out all these cool facts because it's a very interactive museum. If you go downstairs, they have stuff about seismic activity and the planets. It's, it's really cute and cool and then you get to see all of LA while you're up there. The LACMA is another place that people like to visit. The La Brea Tar Pits where you can see like the mammoth bones from mammoths that got stuck in the tar pits. Um, I think you should try food that you can't get anywhere else. There's a lot of good fusion food here like the um, Komodo Dragon, uh, the Gabi Bowl. I can't remember all the names because I usually just go to food trucks. But uh, there's a lot of fusions of like Mexican and Asian foods. There's great Korean barbecue out here. There's great ramen. Anything that you can't get uh, wherever you are, you should try the food while you're here. If you decide which kind of food you like and message me, I, I can tell you exactly which food you should go to. Okay, so that's food. That's museums. Is there anything else you should do? Hollywood, um, the Walk of Stars will disappoint you. So I don't really recommend it, but if you want to do it, go ahead. There are bus tours where you can see celebrity homes. I heard those are cool. I'm too poor to go on them. Uh, yeah, I think that's, that's a lot. Go to a, go to a barcade if you don't have barcades where you're from, like, uh, like Bar 82 or the One Up. Have you experienced a threesome? Open to having a threesome. I have had a threesome before. I didn't like it. I got up and left butt naked in the middle of it. Uh, I don't like girls. And so I just, you know, when a girl touches me, I was like, ah, ugh. Uh, and I got away. And then, like, we tried to make it, like, okay, what if she doesn't touch you? But the idea that his thing was touching her stuff and then that stuff touched me really grossed me the fuck out. 
Um, as far as like a guy threesome, guys don't really have threesomes. They just run trains most of the time unless they're bisexual. So I didn't really enjoy two guys, one girl threesomes when I was growing up. And yeah, when I was growing up, I was like 15, 16. Didn't know how to say, hey, this isn't what I want. I want it like this. I just kind of let shit happen. Um, so I didn't enjoy those experiences. But yes, I'm open to having uh, two male, two, what's that shit called? Two dudes and me but with the dudes either being way more open with their sexuality or with them being bisexual. Deep throating, but do you enjoy it? I don't enjoy it, no. Why would you enjoy choking all the time? I enjoy looking at a dude's face as he loses his shit. That's about it. All right, guys, that's the end of my question and answers today. Madi, if you're watching, turn this off. You're not old enough to watch this channel. And I might do a different vlog tomorrow instead of a Q&A because I'm going to some cool shit tomorrow. Be sure to follow Santino Bros on Twitter. That is my clue about what I'm doing tomorrow. And go watch Wrestling Compadres. My episode is up and tell them you love me so they'll invite me back. Okay, guys, bye.